Hi friends and welcome to Crumbs from Gerard. Tomorrow we begin the Navina and preparation for Pentecost, the Navina to the Holy Spirit. Last year, if you remember, we took the theme for the Navinas, the fruit of the Holy Spirit, as in Galatians chapter 5. This year, what I plan to do is to take just the first fruit, and that is love. And we take it from 1 Corinthians. Love is patient and kind. Love is not jealous or boastful. It is not arrogant or rude. Love does not insist on its own way. It is not irritable or resentful. It does not rejoice at wrong, but rejoices in the right. Love bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, endures all things. Love never ends. As for prophecies, they will pass away. As for tongues, they will cease. As for knowledge, it will pass away. Each day we will take one of the themes of love as given to us in this beautiful hymn of love by St. Paul. Our source for the themes will be Pope Francis. Some years back he gave us that wonderful apostolic exhortation, Amoris Laetitia, and in that he develops a commentary on this beautiful hymn. So we'll take one theme each day. My dear friends, remember, we can't just decide to have these beautiful aspects of love. But we need to pray to the Holy Spirit to ask Him to give it to us. I tell you, ask and it will be given to you. Seek and you will find. Knock and it will be opened to you. For everyone who asks receives. He who seeks finds. And to him who knocks, it will be opened. If you then who are evil know how to give good gifts to your children, how much more will your Heavenly Father give the Holy Spirit to those who ask Him. My dear friends, the procedure for the Navina will be very simple. We'll have an opening prayer, then the theme of the day as given to us by Pope Francis, the commentary, and then a concluding prayer. Let us now pray as we begin our Navina tomorrow. Lord, grant me the fruit of love. May your love so flow through me that no matter what persons say or do to me, I may be able to respond only with love that you have for me. Shine through me and be so in me, that every soul I come in contact with may feel your presence in my soul. Let them look up and see no longer me, but only you, Jesus. Amen. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son and Holy Spirit, have a wonderful day with Jesus.